these artists and six iPad Pros. Woo! And whichever one of these artists has the best digital art piece after two hours can win up to five grand. Whoa! We're gonna start this video off with two twists. I have 10 topics in here. You will each choose one. Who wants to start? I'll start. Me? Nick said it first. Close your eyes and choose one. Please give something decent. Robot. All right, I love that. ZHC Crafts, last five videos. For this topic, you can look back on our last five ZHC Crafts videos and you can choose one art piece and get inspiration from there. You can choose from glue art, collage art, duct tape, Rubik's Cube, or latte art. Latte art has every topic that Ben would want to do. Dragon, robot, what else? Building? What? Building. <laughs> <laughs> oh no! Wait, that was perfect. Michelle always tells me building's the one drawing she dreads the most. Okay, this one. Wait, before you look at it, what do you want to do? I don't know, creature or something. Reptile. Oh, okay, that's, that's not bad. Close. That's, that's pretty good. close, actually. That's good, that's good, that's good. All right, Vinny, there are five more topics to choose from. You shuffled them up. I'm just making sure you're not cheating on me. How would I even cheat? I don't know. Oh. No. <laughs> Nature. <laughs> all right, Mackenzie. Yeah, I don't I'm, like I'm that taking a look at the at final all. ones. There are three that you're going to like, and there's one that you're probably going to hate. With my luck? <gasps> what? Yes! You chose the, the best one for you. Oh, God. Let's go. And the second twist, no reference. Oh. All right, good luck. Oh. Good thing I've got a built in reference. <laughs> this video is meant for Ben to win. $5,000 out the drain. There's no hope on this one, man. Nature's like the worst thing. Pretty nervous here. Kind of feel like I have an edge because I can do digital art, but I uh, don't really draw robots. So. Vinny, so just for some context for the viewers, so in the last video that we filmed, when you guys did the phone case, murals you and michelle made a deal oh yeah did we i don't even remember shaking on that did we make the deal or roll the clip so about for the next crass video whichever one of you two wins gets the other person's help for the first 15 minutes of the next crass video all right fine <laughs> so when Michelle starts drawing, you have 15 minutes with her. All right, Michelle, let's make this building. Hey, you. Hello. What can I start with you for 15? Do you want to help me think of an idea? I don't know. What if you do like a little puppy or something? A puppy? How does that work? I don't know. So I got the topic of the last five ZAC Crafts videos, and I'm choosing the topic of robot from Latte Art. And Nick here got robot too, so we're going to see who can draw the better robot. And if you're wondering why the background is green, it's so we can mess around and do stuff like this. Everyone, open up a new canvas. When I say go, you will have 60 seconds to recreate the ZHC Crafts logo. However you want, you can do it in your own style. Go! You guys have exactly 60 seconds. Oh no, oh no. Oh no, I Zach, can't. my pen. All right, remember everyone, it can be in your own style. You have 20 seconds left. What is going on? Three, two, one. All right, everyone, stop what you're doing. Um, it looks like a green potato. Okay. <laughs> it's a poor character. Not bad. You didn't quite finish the bottom. That's actually kind of cute. All right, cool. That's, that's kind of cute. That's kind of cute. Okay, not bad, Ben. Not bad. Oh, the tongue is so thick. It looks like it's choking on its own tongue. Yeah, like I don't want to go to mine. Seriously, <laughs> 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 I never I, I couldn't get the right setting. I didn't want this. I wanted a nice solid line. <laughs> this is a uh, this is some fine art. It's abstract. Man, this is between Ben and Nick right now. You know what? I like both. Why don't you guys just rock paper scissors? Rock, rock paper, paper scissors, scissors shoot. <laughs> Since you won this challenge for the next three minutes, you get reference. Oh, beautiful. Go. Okay, okay. You okay. have three minutes only. <laughs> All right. So I've really never drawn robots off the top of my head. So I'm gonna try to find as many pictures that I can and combine them so I can finish this robot or I get an idea because I don't really know how to come up with this. Sketch. This first challenge just made me realize that the ZHC Crafts logo is basically a reptile, so I might use that as a little bit of reference. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna use this cool portrait of Mr. Freeze from Batman. Yeah. Reference work off this guy and build off of this when I come up with my design. That's not even a robot, that's Mr. I'm Freeze. Gonna, it's an android, but I'm gonna turn him into an android. Michelle, how are you doing on your building? So I had a couple ideas. Turkey, turkey building, and I had a gingerbread house. A gingerbread house could work. I don't like it because I don't know what a gingerbread house looks like. I'd say get an idea soon because you're almost 20 minutes in, Michelle. So you and Nick are just doing the battle of the robots. Yep. What's your plan to beat out Ben? I'm gonna do more of like a, a realism style for this robot. So hopefully my realism can act. Be Ben. Nick, last time we filmed a crafts video with you, you almost got your first crafts win ever. Nick, you were so close to winning your first ever crafts win. We challenge. almost. This has to be it, Zach. I, I, I'm tired of losing. A tiger, I see. Yep. So I'm assuming you're using this as one of your references? Yeah, that's yes. cheating. 
That's no, actually, it's not. That's actually quite smart. What is happening? So I'm doing thumbnails like you taught me to do. Oh, oh, okay. I thought you were doing like a comic strip. So this is the first one. Why am I falling out of the sky? Well, that's option two. Option two is you as a little uh, caveman, and you have a little loincloth going on. Then there's the worm being, you know, almost eaten by a, a bird. And it's just oh, I think that one looks cool. It's screaming, and it's called Worm Scream. You know who's really good at drawing birds? Who specializes in drawing birds? Who? Michelle. <laughs> Maybe you can ask her for some help since you helped her. He did not help me at all. Never yet, mind. Yet, yet. Hey, Michelle. Uh, yeah. You want to make a deal? No. I'll make it worth your while. Okay. You draw me a bird. What do you want? I need reference. I'll give you a reference. I'll give you an idea. I'm thinking I'm doing this bird coming at this worm. I need you to draw me a bird. Wait, did you guys see the bird? <laughs> this is a sketch I, I can't of draw. a bird. I'm not really good at drawing birds. Well, if you're so good at drawing them, I need your help. Oh, uh, no, I can't. Please. I can only draw birds with a reference, and I have no reference. Right now, I'm opening up a new layer up here so that way I can do the line work. And then after that, I'm gonna add some color on this layer down here. Everyone, for this next challenge, you have to get into teams of two. Partner up and come outside with me. Also, grab an egg. Here's how this game works. You and your teammate are gonna be tossing an egg back and forth, and each time you guys catch it, you'll take a step back. Whichever team lasts the longest wins. Are you ready? Yeah. First toss, go. Why did you do that? Step back to here, go. One more step back. Toss. Ready? <laughs> step back. Okay. Beautiful. Toss. Easy mob. All right, now this side. Move back here. Toss. Yo. Oh. Toss. Okay. Oh no, Michelle dropped it. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. Okay. Michelle and Vinny, you two are the first ones out. Toss. Okay, okay that's good, that's good. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Toss. You guys can go one at a time if you guys want. Oh, All right. I'm so sorry. Okay, I'm gonna try. Go. I'm trying my hardest. There's a big advantage on the line. Oh, 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 what was that? You had one job. I said go it to me, like right, to me. Nick and Ben, you two already won, but there's a bonus if you can catch this. Ben, so for this extreme toss, if you guys get it, you guys get an additional advantage. It's gonna be really tough. <laughs> no way, no way! Oh! You guys have a very big advantage. You guys have 15 minutes to decide whose pieces you wanna switch. And then since you guys got an additional advantage, whoever you switch, you guys can grab them to help you for five minutes. Right, they are Okay, we're gonna switch Michelle and Mackenzie. <laughs> Michelle and Mackenzie switch iPad or switch topics. Are you kidding me? Oh. Are you kidding me? I just finished my snow globe. We thought you'd be happy because now you have animals. Oh, nice. Thank you. Mackenzie, Thank you. you have building. Oh. And on top of that, you get to help us for five minutes. Well, let's get this five minutes yeah. over with. I got stuff I gotta do. Who am I helping? I don't need help, so it's whatever Nick needs. I don't know if I need help. Okay. What? Then I'm working on my stuff. <laughs> you guys just wasted an advantage. Here, I thought I was super lucky. But by getting the topic of animal, and then Nick and Ben changed it to building. I was really happy with my snow globe, but it's fine. What, we switched it for you? Yeah, I know, I know, and it's fine, and I think I have a better chance of winning with the animal. Here's the progress on my super weird Zootsy Crafts logo. Hopefully, it can compete with Nick and Ben. Michelle, can you do me a favor? Can you go like this? Perfect, you have raptor claws. Okay, just stay there for a second. I have decided to make Bun Bun for my animal, because I don't have a reference, but I know what Bun Bun looks like. So I blocked in my colors. Right now it kind of looks like a, like a child drew this. That's just a little base outline and then once we now have to do little details and shading. I'm scared I'm not gonna finish. I don't think I'm gonna finish this, but I'm just adding a lot of wrinkles to this world. We are officially at the halfway mark, which means you guys are running low on time. However, we are about to have a very interesting challenge. So everyone, come outside with me. And everyone, so on the field, I have hidden a paintbrush. So for this challenge, this is the paintbrush they're gonna be looking for. They're gonna have to find it. Oh no. First person to find it gets a huge advantage. Go! Oh. I feel like knowing Zach, he would put it close so then everyone runs away. I don't know how they're gonna find it. This field's huge. One clue, it's on this half. A hint, Michelle's closest. Where is it, where is it, where is it, where is it? I found it! <laughs> Michelle was right next to it and Jake just snatched it. Jake! 
Do you want to know the reason why I hit a brush? It's because you get to change the brush on three people's settings for the next 15 minutes. Say no more. Stop Don't. working for a second. Stop working. Jake, listen, all right? I didn't, I didn't punish you. Get you get to use thing. sword grass. For how long? 15 minutes. No, <laughs> what am I gonna do? So Jake's advantage is that he gets to switch brush settings on three people's pieces. Oh my goodness. Oh, I, I like how you didn't choose mine. Wow. Mm -hmm. Just so you guys know you Give me that. <laughs> Right. Polygons. All right, Jake has chosen. Uh, Driven snow. Okay, I can work with that. I'm not gonna lie, that advantage was pretty good. I heard Nick saying that he was struggling to finish anyway, so this is definitely gonna set him behind even more. How do you use this brush? Can I? You can't shade with this brush. You can't shade with this brush. Uh, my Apple Pencil isn't connecting to my iPad right now, which okay, kind of sucks because because I needed to draw. My paintbrush is horrible. Okay, right now I have the color purple selected. And this is what comes out. Oh. That's not purple. Zach, is it 15 minutes up? Yeah, it actually is. Oh, oh perfect. No okay, cool. Everyone, we have one more challenge. I call this ZHC Crafts Trivia. No. Oh, man. So you need to score two points in order to win this. First question, how many subscribers does ZHC Crafts have right now? You guys can say an exact number and whoever's closest wins. Five mil. 50,000. 5.36 mil. Five million. 43,000. 5.38. 5 5.052. 5,053,000. 5 Jake wins this! <laughs> <laughs> I wanted to go last! <laughs> no, I was, I was like, that's why I wanted to go All last because right. I knew you would do that! All right, the exact number as of this recording is 5,072,000. Oh. Which day did we start the ZHC Crafts channel? I'll say February 7th. 2020. May 19th, 2019. March 17th, 2020. April 20th, 2019. May 19th, 2020. May 18th, 2020. Mackenzie, you get this one. Third question, exactly how many views does the ZHC Crafts channel have? 650 million. 63 million? 198 mil. 275 mil. 600 million? 420 million. Nick, you were closest. What did you say? Wow. 650? Uh -huh. It's 680 million. How many community posts do we have on our community tab? Ben? I don't know, like 17? 20. Tab. 30? 9. 22. Vinny, you are the closest. We actually don't post a lot on the community tab. We only have four. Everyone, I'm going to play a video. First one to tell me the title of this video gets a point. You guys can only guess once. Oh. Sticky note? No. There's a lot of small details that I'm trying to get. Toothpaste. Uh, yes! Ben, no. you got it! I'm my brother, but that's okay. This reminds me of the others. Yes, Ben, I saw your snack hand. How did you what? get that from Because that's the that only time we've ever done a sibling one. So here's your advantage, Ben. You get five extra minutes, and you get to draw a thin line across anyone's piece. Nick. Ben. And you can't erase it. Ben, one streak. I have to pick the ugliest color. Oh! All right. All right, you know what? Then I'm disappointed. Nick, so your options are yeah. you can add another layer, you can draw over it. But technically, could I be able to like go like this? Yeah. Nick is going so fast, just erasing everything. I'm trying to get rid of everything so there was nothing yep. ever happened. My last two minutes though to get There's rid of this completely. Many. Yep. I have two minutes to come up with a children's book title involving a worm being eaten. Um. Time is up. Everyone, except for Ben, stop what you're doing. Ben, you have exactly five minutes. Five extra minutes to add some finishing touches to my piece. I didn't get to finish. If I can come close to winning, I'll be happy. All right, Ben, you have four, three, two, one. All right, Jake, let's start with you. Let me start by saying that I'm not very proficient in digital art and I didn't really do it, so it's not gonna be as good as Ben's or Nick's. But okay, no worries. I went with your idea. I made a weird ZHC cross. Okay. <laughs> oh, interesting. I'm not quite sure what it reminds me of, but it reminds me of this like weird alien fetus. Where's the hair? I didn't put it, it was a style uh, preference. I think <laughs> that the no hair really changes it up and makes it look extra wrinkly and bald like. It definitely does get my attention. Nice. I did bun bun in space because my topic was, became animal. What do we feel like Michelle might actually get a decent amount of votes? Yay! That's really cute, Michelle. I like it. Good job, Michelle. I got the topic of last five ZHC crafts videos, so I chose robot from Latte Art because Nick's doing a robot, so I wanted to do one too. <laughs> Basically, it's just a cyborg robot just hanging from like robotic stuff. I am very curious to see which robot wins. Good job, Ben. First of all, you got the topic of robot. Do you want to explain this robot to me? I got a chance 
wants to use a reference, so I used Mr. Freeze from the Batman series. And is he a robot? He's like, an, well, he's an, I made it like a little Tony Stark android, so like he's a robot. This is just kind of winged, and then this like is like Darth Vader. I'm not very familiar with him, but I'm pretty sure it's a human inside. He's an android, I promise. I mean, it looks very, very nice. I like the color scheme. I like all your details. Ben uh, was able to draw a pink line, and he drew it, and I was able to cover some of it, but a lot of it was not covered, so. Uh, very nice, Nick. I was originally given the topic of animal, and I would have had an amazing piece of art, but then oh. it was switched to building, and I can't draw buildings looking at a reference without, let alone. <laughs> Wait, what, what are you trying to say? I'm trying to say that my art is poop. This is inspired by Dr. Seuss. I mean, I don't think it's too bad. It actually looks like it could be in a children's book, and, and I feel like the trees on the side look very cute, and I feel like your color scheme was nice. I actually don't think it's as bad as you say it is. Pretty solid. Thanks. So I did a child's book, and uh, this is nature. It's called Worm Farm. What's then, that? That's some hay bales. It's so small. Well, yeah, that's perception. perception. Excuse me? If you're trying it's to get perspective, I don't think it was the right. <laughs> it looks very funny. I like the expression. Very nice. Thank you. All right, everyone, here is how the judging is going to work today. I will be sending random subscribers all of these pieces, and they will choose their two favorites. First to five points wins. <laughs> even worse. So I just sent it to a random subscriber and they voted for Ben and Nick. Oh, oh my god, god, stop. This random subscriber just cast in their vote. First vote goes to Nick. God, stop. Second vote goes to Michelle. <laughs> Our third subscriber has voted. The first vote goes to Ben. Second vote, Nick. Oh, stop. stop. Okay, the fourth subscriber has voted. They voted for Michelle. <laughs> And the second vote goes to Vinny. <laughs> Vinny, you are officially ahead of Mackenzie and Jake. Oh this next subscriber has voted. The first vote goes to Nick. Oh my God. Second vote, Michelle. <laughs> Nick, you're one vote away from your first victory ever on ZHC Craft. This literally happened the last shoot we did. The next subscriber has voted. The first vote goes to Vinny. Vinny. Why yes? <laughs> The second vote goes to Nick. Oh, oh is that a win? Is that a win? Yeah. That's a win! That's a win! You finally won your first ZHC Crafts video, Nick. I won. Oh my god. Nick, do you have anything to say to the people that are supporting you? Thank you so much. I finally won a Crafts video! And it was digital art, which is my favorite medium, so thank you. Hey. Ben, you did a great job. Hey, Ben. Uh, hey, Ben. I grabbed six artists and a ton of pencils. You guys will have three hours to make art with nothing but pencils, and whoever has the best piece gets to win up to five grand. Yeah. We're gonna start off with a twist right off the bat. Vinny, phone. I'm going to make this extra difficult on you guys today. No references. And since drawing is very dear to me, I chose a ton of topics that I would really enjoy drawing. So, David, why don't you pick one? A cartoon. <laughs> Your choice. What? Lost Demogorgon. <laughs> oh, sea creature. I hope you guys are all happy with your themes. You have three hours, go. I have been looking forward to this challenge all week. My favorite form of art is drawing. It's really exciting to see all of them try my medium. I'm gonna be just fine. These two. <laughs> My biggest competition, Ben. <laughs> Ben's gonna make it to the finals today. We're all gonna lose! I'm a little bit panicking, but that's okay, because we are used to this. I can do no reference. I think I'm just gonna ask Ben for a lot of help. I think I'm gonna do like a demon character with like a cool samurai mask. I will, however, allow them to use 10 minutes of my help. And I am gonna feel like I'm missing out if everyone's drunk except for me. I want so. you. I need you. Yeah. I need you right now. I need you now. Oh, actually, right. Ten minutes only, and then afterwards, I need to give you guys a challenge. What I really need is anatomy, but mainly I just need help with the shading. I love Stranger Things, but how am I supposed to draw a Demogorgon without a reference? Okay, so this is a little rough right now. I think Ben will know how to turn this into a good piece. Let's check in on David. Oh, that looks pretty cute. I'm gonna do all the cartoon characters, but I'm gonna make them have really big attitudes. I like it so far. <laughs> Trying to draw like some shapes and get like sushi. Kind of, uh, no shapes. I would suggest you 
start out a couple rough sketches so you kind of know what you want it to look like. I think I'm gonna do a split picture. I really don't think you're gonna be able to do two. Okay, fine, I'll focus on one. I think Ben and Jake have the obvious advantage in this challenge because they are very good without reference. So we'll see what happens. Ben gave me the idea of having turkey come out of a grave. This is still very hard to do. This is the first video that me and Ben sat next to each other ever. Hey, hey, near out. Before we do the first challenge, if anyone wants some help, I have time for one more person. Mine, 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 mine. I have an idea. We each put a sharpener in, and then you close your eyes and pick one. Oh, okay, that works. Guys, don't make a single noise. This! Yes! <laughs> All right, Jake. You have 10 minutes of my help. Definitely knew I needed Zach's help to get the kind of structure and proportions right, because Zach's used to drawing creatures. I think especially since they have no reference, just having like a good base is gonna help them a lot. I think I might just submit it like that. If you guys wanna follow me outside, we have our first challenge where you could get an advantage in this video. I know you're gonna win, so don't target me because I didn't target you last video. Okay. We're gonna play a game called Put It In The Hole. Oh. Over there, there's a cornhole, and each one of you guys will get three bean bags. Whoever gets the most inside the hole, Win. Let's see it, Michelle. Kobe. Kobe. Oh, nice. Are you shaking? Kobe. 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 Well, there's two things I know, Zach. It's corn and holes. Huh? All right, you got it, David. Kobe. Whoa. What? Uh, I then already can't win. Mackenzie, you're up. Kobe. Kobe. Oh, two. This is the deciding throw. Kobe. Oh. All right, Jake. Kobe. Kobe. Kobe! No way! You better not target me. This time, you're standing back here. Kobe! Kobe! Whoa! If you miss, you're out, and it's just Vinny and Mackenzie. I'm scared now. <laughs> no! Now you guys have to stand back here even further. Kobe! Wow! <laughs> Ah. First thing you win is my help for an additional five minutes. And the second thing is I'll let you make a bet. If you can guess who's gonna win this competition, I'll give you $500. Oh! Okay. You put your bet on Ben. If Ben wins this competition, I'll give you $500. If you didn't want to vote for Michelle, what did you mean? 500 is better than zero. You still help him? Yes. Okay. Just like the Sharpie Art video, just like the ballpoint pen video, I don't think I really have anything to worry about. Except for Jake. Jake's kind of making me nervous right now. Okay, so Sweet. Vinny has a cute little octopus sushi chef. Michelle, you said you needed my help Yes! If I were to sabotage somebody, I would choose Vince's. Zach definitely helped Vince with the octopus. That's the only reason why I look so good. You should keep asking Ben for help. Because yeah. not only does it help you, it also wastes his yeah. time. Oh, now I don't want to do it! I'm not gonna lie, doing so many is tiring me out a little bit and my hand's kind of cramping. Please help me. So your style doesn't necessarily match with mine, but I can help you map things out. Just do whatever you think needs to be done to make it look better. I'm really proud of myself for doing most of it on my own. Maybe if I would have used Zach's help sooner in the challenge, it would have been pretty bussin'. No we cap on God. I feel like if you can at least get it finished, it's gonna be a decent piece. So all the artists are hard at work. Little did they know. I am about to have a little challenge for them. Everyone, take one of these. Each one of you guys are getting a pencil puzzle. First person to complete the puzzle gets an advantage. Go. Oh gosh, the corner's so confusing. So I rarely ever see Michelle win these mini challenges. I think this is one that she can actually complete. Today's the day, today's the day. I hate this. But Michelle is dominating. You only I got, got the first piece. I'm so excited. I love puzzles so much. Get that out of my face. Look at Michelle, look at David. I always catch Michelle doing puzzles. Oh my goodness, Michelle only has two pieces left. Michelle's done. Everyone stop. First thing is you get my help for 10 minutes. Oh, that's a lot. And second thing, you get to eliminate one tool from anyone. <laughs> no, no, get away from me. You need to look at theirs. I'll take away the eraser. This is why you're my nemesis in every single crafts video we do. I'm very happy with my decision on choosing Vince. Totally not fair. Sucks <laughs> so bad. Guys, keep in mind we have less than an hour left. My hand's kind of cramping. I keep making these advantages where I get to help them draw more, but, but I kind of just want to draw. All right, David. You have this whole area to draw. Yeah, just okay. do simple silhouettes and I can go and finish them. Four more minutes. Oh, yeah, go to town, King. <sighs> I feel like you guys need another challenge. No. Oh, no. no! Put down your pencils and come with me outside for our third and final challenge. Challenge time. Oh, man, it's golf. Yeah. I hate golf. Whoever hits it in the least amount of strokes gets an advantage. Loser gets a punishment. Oh. Wow. 
Nope. That's three. All right, four. No way. Whoa! Nope. That's three. Four hits. Nope. Five hits. Hold two. Hold two. Hold three. Hold three. All right. Three. Whoa! Fight. Oh, oh, two hits. Three. Nope. Four. Yeah. What the? Nope. Um, no, 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 no. All right. Vinny, first of all, for losing, you have 100 push-ups. What? Ben, for winning, you get two things. You get to give someone else 100 push-ups, and you get to eliminate a tool from anyone. Ken's 100, go. <laughs> Fine, I'll do 50 push-ups for you. Honestly, I'm not gonna lie. I think if I were to sabotage anyone right now, it'd probably be Jake. Screw the truce. I'm going for Jake. I'm starting to get nervous, man. Okay, Jake, no blending stump. So, no more blending stump for you. Mackenzie, your elbows need to bend to 90 degrees. Well, that's it. That's all we can do. 47 more. All right, Michelle, you want my help now? Yeah, sure. Zach definitely helped my piece a lot. He really does help me with details. This time, I actually worked on the piece myself, and I'm really proud of it. Girl power. I have no girl power. Honestly, Michelle, I think you have a chance to win. Jake, what are you doing? Oh. Wait, what? Why? Jake! I'm making upside down no, this. If I had a blending stuff, it would probably be a lot easier. No, but you didn't have to do that. <laughs> Guys! I think Jake is cracking under pressure. I think it's last place, or you think I have a chance? I think anyone has a chance here. There's a chance. Three minutes left. For our final minute, we're gonna get another challenge. No, we're not. I'm just messing with them. This is really fun because I feel like I collaborated with all my friends on these pieces. All right, one minute left. Oh, oh, really all right, 20 seconds. My piece isn't even close to being done. Now I'm not gonna finish. Looks like Michelle's getting as much help as she can get. Five, four, three, two. My, my hand kind of cramped for a second. One. Hands up. David, why don't we start over here? Tell me about your piece. This is my club of gorgeous, fatty female cartoon characters. Because they're just too sassy and gorgeous for regular cartoons. So they hang out in this club. Yo, honestly, it turned out better than I thought. Very nice, David. Hi. All right, Michelle. So I know you felt like you were struggling a lot this challenge, but so why don't you tell me about it? Uh, my thing was zombie and I do not know what a zombie looks like. I got a lot of help from Ben, and I got a lot of help from you. I feel like at first, you were like about to give up, and then you realized it actually didn't look that bad. So I think you should be very happy with yourself. <laughs> ben, tell me about your piece. I made a little demon character on top of a tree branch. I think I helped Michelle a little too much. <laughs> and I did Mackenzie's push-up, so there was a lot of lost time. Yeah, it does look a little incomplete. I feel like the shadow on the legs looks better than the shadow on the branch. Well, Ben, at the end of the day, it's not a bad piece. I think the face looks really cool. Nice job, Ben. All right, Jake, tell me about your piece. I got Topic of Demogorgon, and obviously you sketched out the functionality of its body. I added this upside down mist covering part of its face, and then I just used eraser marks. To I really thought you were gonna have a very incomplete piece, but your last minute mist actually kind of saved it a little bit. Very nice, Jake. Thank you. All right, Mackenzie, tell me about your piece. Well, I got the topic of dragons, so I did a fiery little dragon. And most of this base sketch is done by me. Overall, not a bad piece. Good job. All right, Vince, tell me about your piece. Well, I tried to create a new character, so I had to go off the reference. Sea monster. He's a sous chef. He's a sushi chef. So he's a sushi. Maybe his name should be Susie. Susie does so many should bake in a buttery crazy. <laughs> Everyone partner up. Winner lose. Yeah. I think you did great. Both I'm gonna ask my subscriber which one they like better out of the pair, and whoever wins moves on to the top three. So I asked my subscriber, Manu, which one do you like better? Manu has made her decision. Any guesses? Mackenzie! Aofi Fitzpatrick has made her decision. The person moving on to the next round, Ben! Oh! All right, David and Michelle. So I just asked Charlie which piece he likes the best. I hope he likes zombies. And the winner of this round, David! Oh! David, Ben, Mackenzie, you guys are in the final three. Close your eyes. I thought of a number from one through three. Whoever guesses that number moves on to the next round. Two, one. Well, I guess three. All right, Ben, you're in the finals by default. I asked Jasmine which one her favorite one was. 
Mackenzie! Are you nervous at all about going up against Ben? No, because I know I'm going to lose. So for this final round, we will do a best of three, so we'll be asking three subscribers. Ooh. No! Okay. So I asked a random subscriber, Ryan, which one is her favorite piece? The first vote goes to... Benjamin! So for the second vote, I asked Bane which one his favorite was. And the second vote goes to... Vinny gets 500 bucks for betting correctly. You gotta play me in rock, paper, scissors. Rock, rock paper, paper, scissors, scissors shoot, shoot, shoot. shoot. Ah, paper, on, scissors, shoot. Go. Ah. What can I say? I'm good at rock, paper, scissors. In this video, we're gonna be making art using glass. Whichever one of these contestants has the best art after five hours gets to split five grand with a subscriber. Catch money. They're on a team, that's not fair. Do you guys have any questions? How do we use all of this stuff? Good question, Jake, which brings me to our next segment, Mackenzie safety demonstration. Right, everyone, put on your protective safety glasses and gloves. The only person that's ever wanted to do mosaic art that I know of is Mackenzie, and she made this challenge. I'm just here for the ride. Do I need to put on that vest? Well, this is for me because I'm special. I don't even know what these tools do. There's various ways you can go about breaking this. Is you can take this handy dandy little tool. Ooh. That sound hurts my ears. And and then you take this. And then you're just gonna prop. Whoa! Whoa! Mosaic art seems really hard, but it's really gorgeous if you do it right. Other way you <laughs> is you can take this tool. I'm just gonna go like this. Whoa! Whoa! Here's some bad. That's actually That's really satisfying. Idea. Did you fart because it smells really bad? That's probably you. I am very excited for this challenge. I hope everyone stays safe because, as you guys know, glass is sharp. I feel like these could look so cool with the colored glass. Also, I think this is the shortest my hair has been in like 15 years. So enjoy it while you can. What are you making? You don't get to know until I win. I feel like I'm gonna win. I wanna make something really cool. I'm not gonna do a dragon because dragon's too basic, right? So I'm either considering a samurai mask, never done that before, or an orca whale. All the pieces are gone! Where are all the pieces? What the hell? That just broke. I guess I have blue and teal to work with. Everybody has all of the supplies and I have nothing. Oh my God. Jake is being so such a victim right now. Oh, this is so easy and fun. What are you? Oh, stop it! She's being such a victim. Editor, put so, put a lot of this content in. You, sometimes the content gets. Yeah, I had a glass stuck in my foot once. When someone threw a bottle on the ground, and I stepped on it. So I'm terrified of glass. Oh my God! Michelle's breaking everything. Broken glass. I was thinking of doing something with wings because wings would look so pretty. Kenzie drew her design and freaked me out, so I drew mine too. Good. I've never done a pheasant before and I'm excited. I'm just gonna try to finish as fast as I can so that way I can play basketball with Zach. Okay, let's go see what they're working on. Is that a frog I see? Do you think a frog's gonna be impressive enough to win? I've seen what my competitors are doing and yeah. Mackenzie's making a peasant. I'm making a pheasant! Pheasant! <laughs> Michelle, that sketch is looking promising. I'm copying this, but I also want to make it different. I don't know how to change it up, though. You can change up the colors, you can change up the feathers on it, stuff like that. Hey, Zach, we have a meeting right now. Oh, no! Have you made one of these before? No, that's why I'm doing it. I'm being so unique and so creative. Look, I'm gonna do a pretty mom. This looks promising. Mama wants a couch. And this <laughs> mama also wants a couch. Yo. Ben and I have a meeting right now. I'm showing up to the meeting with these on. The glass is very scary. There's like little shards, and it hurts when it gets into your skin. <sighs> so far, this is really hard, and I don't like it. Wait, Kenzie, how do you break it? Like Score it, then... break it. Okay, that worked. Oh, I'm scared because I'm so clumsy. <sighs> Wait, that didn't work at all! Who came up with this video? Do you need help? Oh, Michelle, what? Michelle. what are you doing? What is going on? I'm trying to break in half! Ta-da! Read him and Bye. weep! This is gonna win! You haven't even started, really. It's all right. You watch me be better than everybody at this table. With Ben's meeting over, he returned to his piece. The meeting went really good, but I did lose 30 minutes in. Oh, sorry. We're around an hour into the challenge, so I decided to check in with the artists. Raise your hand if you're hard at work. Me. Me. But I'm working so hard, I can't raise my hand. Whoa, Whoa. Michelle, that looks so pretty. That's pretty? Yay. I got one piece of really good, and then everything else is scattered. Wait, what happens if I blow this? No, don't. I'm gonna breathe it in. So you don't have any glass down I yet. I was in a meeting as well. You had a meeting? Yeah. 
with the President of the United States. Right, everybody? That doesn't sound very convincing. And with at least some progress being made, it was time for our first mini challenge. All right, we have our first challenge, and the advantage is quite brutal. No! I'm really liking my piece so far, so I hope I don't lose the mini challenge. Here is how this mini challenge is gonna work. You will each have five minutes to create a mini glass piece. Any guesses what the winner gets? Mm. They get to switch two people's artwork. <gasps> oh. When you switch pieces, you can restart and reframe it, but you can't go back to your original topic. Go! I think I'm feeling pretty good because they work as pixels on this. I built a lot of these in Minecraft before. I want the frog. What? No! I want the frog. If I were to get anything, I would want the frog too. That's not fair. Okay, I see a couple good pieces here and there. Not no. quite sure what Michelle's trying to make. Guys, don't take frog away. I didn't even start yet. This might be close. 30 seconds. No. All right, everyone finish up. Five, four, oh. three, two, one. Hands in the air. In the air! Oh. Like All right, cute. Mackenzie has a cute underwater scene. Mine's a cute above the water scene. It's a little messy, David. I don't know. <laughs> I have a super clean jack o' lantern oh, face. Oh, oh, Chicky didn't finish. What? I did a chubby bunny. Whoa, Ben, you have an entire character. I made Master Ugwe. I think I'm going to have to give this one to Ben. Yes. You have five minutes to decide yeah. their fate. Guys, I'd recommend being extra nice to Ben. Not me, Ben, not me. <laughs> I think I should be ruthless this challenge. Or I can be a nice friend. I want everyone to give me a plea for each person. Jake? No, Ben. Everyone was saying that they would want my piece. Well, maybe I should have it. No. <laughs> Michelle? Please don't choose twice. I can help you if you don't pick me. Convincing. And... Don't pick me because I could even cut the glass right. David's been punished the least out of all of us. But Jake, you've also been punished the most, so why not continue the tradition? No, I know I always get punished. Ben's just playing with people's hearts at this point. Jake, what can you offer me? What would you like? 20 seconds. You have to help me for 20 minutes then. Ben, I need names in 10. Ben, you said that we were on team. Uh, eight, uh, they're seven, teaming up together. Six, they're teaming uh, up. Three, two, one. Names. These two. Oh! Why would you do that, Bean? Yeah, you guys are working together. With their topic switched, David and Mackenzie had to come up with a new plan. What the hell is this? <laughs> I can't do it. I just saw my life flash before my eyes. <sighs> I had a feeling that Ben was gonna switch my art. Yeah, I was always gonna choose Mackenzie from the start. Do you remember what happened to Etch-a-Sketch? <laughs> Wait, it's probably already messed up! I didn't do anything! So, it didn't matter. The grudges for punishments are real. David literally only had three pieces of glass on his artwork. I just decided that I was gonna start over. And I'm so sad to see my pheasant go. I tried to be unique what? and I tried to do a new idea, but then I got screwed over, so I'm doing a tiger. We're over an hour and 10 minutes into this challenge and I still haven't put any Anything down on my board. Kenzie gave me her rusty pheasant. I mean, it's actually kind of good, but I don't know what a pheasant is, so I don't know what I'm gonna do. Can I do it not a pheasant? It's an ugly bird. David, do not! Kenzie, but I don't like that, what but that it looks, looks like. it looks so good! It does look good, but the bird is ugly. Do you want a new couch or not? If you do tear it all off, what would you do? I don't know, I don't know. It looks like you get to keep your frog. I know, I'm so excited because I literally have only been cutting pieces of glass for my frog. Jake, are you still helping me? Is that part of it? Yeah, I said I want to have 50 of you said deal. I agreed to work with Ben for 20 minutes and I cut him a lot of glass, so I think that helped him a lot. I'm so glad he chose David and Mackenzie because David and Mackenzie are making an alliance together because they want a new couch. And I feel like that's cheating. I didn't plan on doing this next challenge, but I was starting to get bored, so... Everyone, we have another mini challenge. This one may be the stupidest one yet. What do you mean? In this bowl are a ton of different cards. It has anywhere from zero minutes to 30 minutes. And that is how long you have to stare at this piece of glass for. No! Just so you guys know, there's a ton in here and there's only one that says 30 minutes. There's a lot that says zero, so you could get lucky. All right, Jake, reach behind you. All right, let's see what you get. Don't get the 30 minutes. Oh! Did he get the 30 minutes? There's only one in here, Jake. R.I.P. Jake. I'm not having a good day. All right, Michelle. Give me the five. Zero minutes. You don't need to stare at it at all, Michelle. Where's the glass? Here. Give it, I want to no, start. It's just a piece of glass on a wall. Have fun, Jake. Ben. <laughs> Choose wisely. Zero minutes. You're dropping a lot, but Sorry. it's okay. Zero, zero minutes? minutes? Nice. Wait, wait, I'm telling you guys, there's a lot of zero minutes in here and there's only 130. And everyone else is just gonna get zero. Zero. <laughs> it's pretty fitting that Jake got the 30 minutes because he never finishes his pieces and now he really won't finish his piece. I appreciate you cutting the glass for me. <laughs> I can't believe we had so many in there and Jake chose the one that said 30 minutes and everyone else got zero. I don't know if I'm gonna have enough time to finish my piece now. And after 30 minutes of staring at the glass, Jake was finally able to get back to work. 
Ah, it's ending. <sighs> Little did he know, I had another challenge planned for the artists right away. This next challenge, they're gonna guess what I'm making, and this is the thing I'm making. It's a lizard eating an apple. All right, I'm gonna make a piece of art. First person to guess what I'm making wins a big advantage. A lizard licking a hairy butt. Tent, a house. Bicycle, a lizard eye. A dragon eye. Maybe I'll go that way too. A snake uh, a eating an apple. Eating an apple. Yes, like you got it. A lizard eating an apple. That's clearly a snake right well, now. Well, I wasn't done yet. <laughs> ben, you gotta choose someone and they're gonna help you for 30 minutes. <laughs> no! Ken. No, Bean, I literally am not gonna finish. Please don't. Ben, you got a big decision to make. Ken, can you Bean, help me? Bean, please, I'm not gonna finish. Please, no. Well, I need your help. All right, Mackenzie, for the next 30 minutes, you are helping Ben. I'm not gonna finish. And Mackenzie, you gotta be a good sport. You gotta do your best. Ben would pick me to help him for 30 minutes because I literally have nothing done on my piece. I don't know how I'm supposed to finish now. Can we do like some black with like a yellow eyeball? Also, there is a twist. If you lose this competition, you have to stare at a piece of glass for 30 minutes. No! <laughs> Why can't we just get shards of glass thrown at us? Aren't you supposed to be working, Ben? I'm directing. Very nice, Ken. So basically what I'm doing right now is making an eye that's a lot better than the one that Ben made. So you think I should yeah. restart? Bean gets like this where if he doesn't think he's gonna win, he just gives up. He doesn't give up. He just spends the last two hours playing basketball with me when he doesn't like his piece. Ben, you're pulling a me! Just so you guys know, normally we have a list of maybe like five or six crafts challenges. We usually only end up using like three, maybe four of them. But today, I think we're just gonna run through every single challenge. Sound good, everyone? No! no. Wow. We need to extend the time then. But I'm bored. I want to do more challenges. Despite my boredom, I decided to let the artist work for a little while longer. Mackenzie, you have 13 minutes left. I'm doing Ben's entire piece right now. Thank you. I like how my piece is looking, although it's not looking finished. Check this out. Check this out. Hey. Jake, we're halfway through the video and you have pupils in. <laughs> so everyone else isn't being a perfectionist and they have spaces between the glass. There's no spaces in between my glass. It's all one big space. <laughs> <laughs> Is your time done? Thank you, Ken's. Ken's did more work in 30 minutes than I did the last two hours. I don't think I'm gonna finish, but I really am gonna try. <laughs> all right, so everybody's been a little bit crunched on time and they're all stressing about if they're gonna finish or not. So I'm gonna pull a little prank. I wrote down ridiculous amounts of time. 60 minutes, 30 minutes. And we're gonna start with Jake. He's really gonna freak out. <laughs> Oh my god, we, we just did a mini challenge, right. Zach, what Everyone, are you doing? Everyone, so for this next challenge, I have a new piece of glass. All right, I'm gonna place it right here. Whatever time you draw, the amount of time you have to sit in the circle and stare at that piece of glass. No! Bro! If I get 30 minutes again, this challenge is over for Jake. <laughs> oh my god! Yeah, no put it back way. in, I put it back. No way! Okay, wait. five minutes. He got a 35 minutes. One. No, I got five. No, it's 35. No! No! All right, Michelle, good luck. No! I grabbed the one I just put in. No! All right, Ben. No. <laughs> what? You guys are just getting really unlucky. <laughs> Zach, no! Wait, this 50? is a parade! Right, I'm gonna walk out before everyone gets mad. All right, that's your time. 40? Your time starts when you start sitting. Can you tell us this is a prank now? Ah, uh -huh, it's a prank. No, just kidding. Wait, what piece you of glass are we staring at? <laughs> okay, I'm just kidding. This is a prank. Get back to work. Oh my god. Oh my god, Zachary, I knew it! I didn't know it was a prank at first. I was traumatized. I was this close to crying. I think that was a pretty successful prank. I knew Zach was pranky ass. Hell though. I knew it. In all seriousness though, we're about to start our next mini challenge. I'm just gonna finish as much as I can though. Jake, you know what I'm gonna say. We're down to our last hour and I see a finished eye and an almost finished eye. What do you think of them? The eyes look good. How are you gonna finish the rest though? Then I can just go like this. Bop. Michelle, it looks so good. Yay! This, I'm trying my hardest for this. This is really video. impressive. I'm happy. What's up, Ben? Wow, Ben. That looks so good. How are you going to finish? By placing the pieces down. That's true. I don't think we're going to be able to play basketball today. We can still play. Okay, I guess we'll play right before judging. Not bad. I'm curious who you think your main competitors are. Michelle's looks really good. And I think my original project looks good. Like what about your other project? Yeah, I think if Ben can finish, it'll look really good. So no more pheasant? Yeah, no more pheasant. 
I thought the pheasant was too dirty and angry looking. So I made him into a rooster. Oh, well, that's pretty cool. And just like that, it was time for our last mini challenge. We are down to our last hour and I have another challenge for you guys. Yeah! So you're gonna take a piece of glass, you're gonna be blindfolded, spin three times, and then you're gonna try to stick it as close to this X as possible. The moment you touch a wall, you gotta stick it there. So the person who gets closest to the X gets to steal 15 minutes from someone. Here you go, Jake. Okay, I'm gonna spin you three times until you're in the same position. Are we in the same direction? We're right behind you, so All just right. listen. All right. <laughs> <laughs> you placed it on the wrong wall. I would've got here, that's basically here. What the heck? Nope. Oh, that was pretty wow. close. Wow. Oh, you got closer. Yeah. Yes. Ben, it's your height, remember. Yeah. Oh. Ben's height. Oh. oh. You guys put me in the wrong direction. No, no, Jake, I faced you in the right direction and you started walking sideways. Wait, what? I want to see the footage. Show me this footage. <laughs> you slowly just rotating. Why did I do that? All right, David, you get to steal 15 minutes from someone and, and add it to your own time. <gasps> Yours is good, but you could buy us a couch. What? You're not gonna finish, Bean. Michelle, I couldn't do it to you. You're gorgeous. How does that make any sense? Yeah. I almost want to give it to Jake. Why? <laughs> I feel like this needs to be like a record for like the least done. Once the clock hits 15, you're done. You're gonna do really good though, and you're setting a new record. Good choice, good choice. I guess that's just how the cookie crumbles. This really doesn't hurt me at all. Jake! I'm dead inside after this video. I have so much time and I don't really need it. I'm spoiled. 45 minutes left. I am struggling to finish, but my current tactic right now is to just get these little tile pieces and place them on as detail. Well, I got bored again. So I came up with another mini challenge. The artists are not gonna wanna lose this one. We have one final challenge waiting for us outside, so let's go do that. The reason why you guys are gonna wanna win this is because the winner will get a hammer one person's art. No! no! Right. Each one of you gets one rock. On the other side is a pane of glass. If you shatter it, you move on to the next round. Okay, throw responsibly, please. Hey, right, Jake. Oh! I'm not gonna be able to hit it. Oh no, I'm gonna get my beast smash. Oh. Yeah! I'm not gonna make this hey. one. Oh. Ben, Jake, Mackenzie, you guys are in the next round. You guys will be throwing from back here. What? Go for it. Don't get it, don't get it. Oh. No. I can do this! No, don't you can't! Yes, I can! No, you can't! No! I am more on the line than those two because no one's gonna smash their pieces! I'm not nervous because they're not gonna hit my piece. And if they hit mine, well, I'll be not really to... upset! Oh! No! 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 Back up! Back up! Alright, let's go! Oh! No! no! Wait, what? I guess the basketball. Oh my god! That was actually crazy. Mackenzie threw the rock and it broke the very corner of it. So it almost missed, but she got it. Girl power! In my opinion, oh, she's wow. being a little bit dramatic. Can someone make a montage of all of Jake's tantrums on ZHC craft? Well, I want to see the back of George Washington's head in Mount Rushmore. What is going on? Bean, do you not care about yours? I think you should be worried about Michelle's piece. No, no, no. I'm not even done. Hey, Michelle. No, no, no. I know you're not calling my name. I'm so sorry, Michelle. I have to get some. No, girl power, right? I will help you once I'm done. Should we just give Jake like a quadruple whammy and just destroy his? No. Look at this one. The rooster. Hey. Well, Ben's not gonna finish, and Jake's not gonna finish, and you're gonna buy I'm furniture gonna buy for crowd. our house. I'm smashing the shelves. No, 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 she didn't, she didn't mean that. This can probably do a lot of damage to one spot. So you go six inches and then you can whack it. Safety first. I didn't even give you a name yet. Oh, that's gonna make me feel worse about this. Sparkles. So sparkles. sparkles. Everyone, a moment of silence. I hope you miss. You might want to go a little bit to the left. Ah! Oh! oh. Well, none of those were glued down. Literally nothing broke. Wait, well, I guess when you glue down glass, it kind of just stays. Sparkle lives another day. Um, the only things that were ruined were the things that I did not glue down. Oh, one more thing. Jake, you're done in a minute and 45 seconds. Yeah. And honestly, if I were you, I'd just grab pieces right now and just like try to fill it in. I think it looks nice. So you're completely done? Yes. It's time for basketball? Yes. I mean, I can't stop you. Let's go. <laughs> this is the hardest I've tried for a craft video. Even if I don't win, I feel like my piece is gonna look really, really good. 
<laughs> Nico, don't put any Nico, keep that in. I've been really rushing. Thankfully, my cheetah is coming together, and I actually think it looks pretty good. So I beat Zach in 23 to 0. It was Wait, pretty, what? It's a pretty good game. Nicola doesn't need to put in any of that other what? footage. Everyone, time is up. Unless your name's David, in that case, you have 15 minutes. No, I didn't get to finish. I think I might have a chance to win this one. If it's not me, I hope it's Kenzie so that one of us can at least afford to buy a couch for the new apartment. Jake, would you mind showing me how much you end up finishing? <laughs> It's finished! Comment on how beautiful the eyes look. The eyes are cool. So you usually plan to cram at the end and somehow you pull it off. This time I think like you plan to do the same thing except for you got a lot of time taken away. So. How are we doing the judging for this video? I don't think it matters. You never know. Good job, Jake. Uh, All right, Michelle, tell me about your piece. So I did a phoenix, but instead of making it red and orange and yellow, I made it pink, purple, and blue. I like the colors. That's yeah. really cute. The only thing I'm disappointed at is the black background. You know what, Michelle? This is your new best piece ever. Yay! This looks awesome. Just don't stand the table too hard. I didn't glue oh. down all the pieces. Oh, okay. This is a red oni mask. I think it looks really good. Did you finish it? No. I've been roommates with Jake too long. It's rubbing off on me. No. I think it looks quite nice. I'm not so sure about the use of the tiles though. I think it works in some areas, but like glue your piece down. is just falling apart. I forgot I didn't glue this down. But not a bad piece. It's bad. All right, Mackenzie, tell me about yours. Well, originally I was doing a pheasant. David and I got switched. I scrapped David's and I went with a cheetah. I think it turned I, out pretty good. I think the blacks are quite solid. Yeah, I wish there was maybe a little bit more somewhere there, but I think it's a pretty solid piece. Very nice. Thank you. All right, David. Hi, Zach. Let's see it. I had Kenzie's pheasant, and I liked it, but then I wanted to turn him into a rooster to make it a little bit more like colorful and exciting. I, I feel like if you had more time, maybe you could have done it like more carefully, because I think you had the right idea for a lot of the places, but maybe you just didn't have quite enough time to like clean it yeah, in certain I was areas. Yeah, the best I could with the time I had. Yours is probably the most complete out of everyone's. It has like an entire background. Yeah. All right. Whoa. I think I just got a piece of glass in my eye. There's glass everywhere, it's terrible. You guys all made amazing pieces. Woo! Jake, if you finished, I'd say yours too. What? But there is only gonna be one winner, and today I'm gonna ask a ton of subscribers what they think. The first person to get three favorite votes wins. The first vote goes to Mackenzie! Boo! The second vote goes to Mackenzie! No! No, no, no! It might actually be good that you switched from a pheasant. One more, then we're getting the couch. Give me a hundred dollars for every time I hear the word count! This next vote goes to... Mackenzie! This just proves if you make a big cat and you love big cats, you'll win. <laughs>